Hello. How are you? Hi, teacher. Nice and you? Fine, fine. Nice to see you. Me too. No, mi amor. Hi, teacher. Hi. How are you? Fine. Not working? Arriving to my home. Oh, nice. Nice. Okay, let's wait a minute and then we start. Sevens today. Mm -hmm. Friday, 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 full of traffic today, right? Was kind of kind of hard. Hi, hi, Victor. Are you still on the way? Hello. Hi. I am driving right now. But in two, 10 minutes, I, I am going to available. Oh, perfect. You're about to get home. Nice, nice. Okay. Well, let's start with the attendance. Mm -hmm. Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. How are you? Fine, thanks. I'm sure. Seven. Friday, finally Friday, right? Let's see, Adriana Maria. Adriana Sofia. Present, teacher. Thanks. Ana. Cruz. Present, teacher. Eddie Jonathan. David. Present, teacher. Elmer Fabricio. Elsa Cristina. Present. Eri, eh, Félix Enrique. Félix. No, Félix. Grace Michelle. Grace, Grace, Yvonne Marcela, Jennifer Elizabeth, Jose Alberto. Present teacher. Nice. Jose Alfredo. Jose Alfredo. Carla Lorena. Mario. Nubia Zulema. Rebecca Marcela, Rebecca me hace I'm going to close my door. Okay. Rebeca Marcela, Rosa Hilda, Victor, 
present teacher? Claudia. Claudia Guadalupe. Mauricio. Anybody that joined later? Me, teacher Carla. Okay. Bueno, voy a más rapidito a todos. Adriana María. Ana. Eddie. Elmer. Félix. Félix Michel. Yvonne. Jennifer. José Alfredo. Carla Lorena. Present. Mario. Nubia. Rebeca, Claudia, Mauricio, ok, ok, bueno, we have present, a... ¿Mm? ah, present, no. hello, hello, Nubia, Vamos. Okay. Now we are 11. Okay. Mario, present. Uh -huh. Mario. Mario, Mario, Mario here. Okay. Okay. Jose Alfredo, where are you? <ríe> ¿Qué le pasó y anda de silencio? Okay. Bueno, let's see. I'm going to share. I'm going to give you the permission to share. And I'm going to share the presentation for today. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, the objective of today's class is to learn how to use enough with nouns. Remember in the previous class when we were using enough with adjectives, we were also talking a little bit about this, right? So we're going to reinforce the topic about how to use and not with nouns. And as promise, right? Uh, we're going to listen to the commercial that yesterday. Who will be my first volunteer? Volunteer. Mm -hmm. Nubia, give me a number. Vamos a, a sacar al volunteer. Um, okay. Um, um, Jose Alfredo. <laughs> Jose Alfredo cannot speak. No, but give me a number. Aquí vamos a, a contar y vamos a ver a quién, 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 quién. Sale solo. Cruz Antonio. Oh, vaya, Cruz Antonio. <laughs> hello, hello. Hello. How are you? Freddy. In my in, in my group, Mario. Mario present the commercial. Maya <laughs> Mario. Your partner is volunteering you. Do you want to share the screen? Yes? Yes. Okay. Go ahead. No, wow. Well. Oh. <laughs> okay. Because we love, we made it. So uh, let me see something. We are seeing my screen. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Well, uh, well, the the story. Uh, well, let's. Bedroom can be anything you want them to be. 
uh, the only the the only are limited by your imagination. The first thing to do is name your pet. Boy. After that, you can teach him tricks. Oh. That, uh, yeah, like like stay there. That, that is a trick. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, There and uh, something have something good about this product is that never needs to be feed or feed it or pet. Um, what else I need to talk about? You never uh, what, the bathroom, yeah. That's yeah, yeah. You never need to clean his his bad thing. Uh, why why we made our product unique? Well, uh, every pet work pet work is original. Organic and unique, uniquely different. Some bigger, some smaller, some smoother, some rouge. Each of them has its own uh, distinct personality or existence to count. You or all will be always your best friend. You may, you may be thinking, why is this product so amazing? And the answer will be, why not? <laughs> right. This product has uh, every every advantage in all products, but no disadvantage. We are not responsible for bad for bad news or abuse. Okay. That's it. Very well. Okay. So if you want to be happy with a pet. Get from Mario a pet rock. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Mario, as you were the first one, you have the right to choose the next one. Who will be the next one? The person, the person, the person who, who, who chose Cruz Antonio. Who, that, that, that's the to be. So maybe it will be Nubia. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bye, Nubia. Okay. Okay. Um, <clears throat> I don't remember which uh, who working. Okay. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. I made a capture of that. Ah, Victor. Victor. Sí, Nubia, Víctor, Elmer y Claudia. Uh -huh. Y estará Víctor. He, he was going home. Sí. He said in 10 minutes. Vaya. Eh, Bye, Víctor. I guess he's still in the way. Okay, Nubia, let's do something. Choose the next victim and then while that Víctor gets home. Choose the next one. David, David. David. Thank you, Nuria. <laughs> okay. David, David, Alberto, and Rosa Hilda, right? Rose is a boy leader. Then Jose Alberto and I is the presentation. Okay, who will present? Rosy. Oh, wow. Okay, Rymax, uh, Rymax advertising. Okay. Hello, Box Bunny. <laughs> I, I see you tired. Do you have terror or sleeping? Yes, there are there are mosquitoes in my house, and I don't, I, I don't know how to eliminate them. I have the solution. Use Rise Max. <laughs> what is that, and how is the use it? Yes, there are mosquitoes in my house, and I don't know how to eliminate them. <laughs> Where I. Can where can I where can I buy it? You can buy it in 
all supermarkets in the country. Right, Max? Do you always find in it in promotion with the special discounts, additional samples, etc. That's it, teacher. Excellent. Thank you. Very good. Very good. Nice. Okay, Victor. Victor, Victor. Did you get home? If not, let's go to the other group. Is Hello. Hola, hola. Hi. Hello. Hello. Give me three minutes. Okay. Okay. Vamos a ver. Eh, Cruz already presented. David too. And the other group is Elsa, Cristina, Félix, Enrique, Jennifer, Elizabeth, and Mauricio. Mm -hmm. Go. Um, ready, ready. Hello. Hello. Uh, which yes, an onion? Is I, which, um, which I um I shared the conversation. Sure, you can which, share. Yeah. No, no, no. Uh, which one? Uh, who is who is talking to me? The teacher. No, in my group. Oh, I don't see anybody talking. The people from your group are Elsa, Cristina, you, Felix, Jennifer, and Mauricio. Felix. Felix. Will you talk to me? Vamos a ver. Hmm. Felix, Felix, are you there? Mauricio is not here. Felix is not here either. You're alone. Jennifer, not here. But we can get Mario to help you, Elsa Cristina. <laughs> right, Mario? What, what about? Uh, you, can, you can share the presentation with Mario and he can help you. I did it because uh, the, other, the other classmate did and he is sick. Oh. I, I didn't. I didn't. I, I don't have the presentation. Mm, okay. Um, Via then, uh, when the others come, you will present it, okay? If no Monday. Okay. The Salva Mario. Oh. <laughs> the Salva Mario. Okay, let's see, Victor. I don't know if the three, your three minutes are finished, Victor. No yet, no yet, ok. Bueno, yo asumo, vea, porque como no me contesta, yo digo, pues, así, tipo Dora la exploradora que pregunta y se responde solita, ¿la han visto? ¿Verdad? Bye. There we go. Check. I have a couple of questions for you. One, what is the process of moving products from the producer? to the intended user. And the other question, how important is placement to reaching the right target audience? How important is placement to reaching the right target audience? We were mentioning a little bit of that yesterday when you were saying Mm, about getting the best or the right place for your product if you really want to sell it to, to sell it when bueno, yeah if you really want to sell because if your product is so far 
If your product is too far from the customers, probably it will be difficult for you to sell it, right? Okay. Who wants to tell me what is the process of moving products from the producer? In Chalatenango, in San Ignacio, the people who are producing the lettuce, the broccoli, the cabbage, to the person who's going to use that product. Hmm? So what is the process for moving that those products? Who wants to tell me? Volunteer. No volunteer. Mm. Can be the transportation? Yes. The, me, the transportation. What, what type of, of me or what mean of transportation do you think will be the best one to be used in that case? Hmm? Sorry, can you repeat? What type of transportation? Yes, but I don't about what. Hmm? About what? Hello, teacher. Hi. I'm going to present my promotion. Okay. Talking about the products, Mario. Any product? Right, let's, let's. <clears throat> Maybe the, the transportation of some things. Uh -huh, but what type of transportation? Well, yeah. Maybe. A lorry? <laughs> A big lorry, right? Oh. Mm, depending on the product. But yeah, we will be back. We will let uh, Ma Victor share. Go, Victor. Okay. Mm. Thank you for my coffee. Are you watching my screen? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Our product is about a product of coffee store, specialty coffee. Okay. Okay. We buy for a buy a cup a cup of coffee, you get a cookie free. Mm. And the other, the other promotion is by on delivery way, if you buy a, a coffee. To get enlarged free is the right side. Okay. That's all. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Coffee and cookie. Yes, coffee and cookie. The perfect combination coffee and cookie. Nice. Bye. We go back to the question. What is the process of moving products from the producing to the intended user code? Mm -hmm. It depends on the product, right? But I was thinking about mm, lettuce, cabbage, or vegetables coming from San Ignacio to San Salvador, where we are going to buy it, or to any department where you're going to buy it. What do you think is the process for moving those products from the place where they are produced to the place where they are going to be consumed? They need to be packaged. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Clean, or they will be dirty. Doesn't matter. What do you think? What? Will you clean them before, before packaging? Yeah, yeah. Okay. After packaging. 
After? Before? Before, before, before. Before, before practice. Okay. And then? How, how important is placement to reaching the right target audience? I'm going to read to you the definition of the word placement. It says placement is the action of putting someone, or in this case, something, in a particular place, or the fact of being placed. Yeah, that's placement. The action of putting someone or something in a particular place or the fact of being placed. Okay. I think it's very important mm -hmm. because the place, the place the, uh, where you put your product, the will be determined by the target audience. For example, if your if your stock or warehouse is in La Union and your target audience is in San Salvador, the delivery was will, will be delayed. Uh, will be too late. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Imagine all the products moving, right? But it is very important. This placement is very important to have the product near the people who are going to buy it. Because I won't go to Chalatenango if I want to buy Nabos, for example. Right? I want them to be here in San Salvador to use them. Or if you want to eat beans, right? You don't want to go to Sultan or any other place in the area that sells beans. You want the beans in the area where you're going to buy them or where you live, right? Okay, very good. I have a conversation for you, check. Let's go through the conversation. Sophia says, I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You could sell your training courses online. People are always using their phones so, uh, to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest in the courses so that people will buy them. Okay, now repeat after me. I would like to sell training courses online. I would like to sell. I would like to sell online. training courses online. I have developed a few. I have. I, the, have, I have developed a few. But I'm not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. But, but I'm, I'm not sure, sure, sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. I think, I think the, the place, place is, is actually, actually irrelevant. irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. You have to take, have advantage, to take advantage of, advantage of, access. of access. What do you mean by access? What, what do, you do you mean, mean by, by access? access? You could sell your training courses online. You, you could, could sell, sell your training, training courses, courses online. online. People are always using their phones to sort the web. People are always, People are so always using their phone to surf the web and learn new things. And learn new things. And learn new things. New things. New things. New things. New things. New things. Mm -hmm. 
this is great because you can create awareness about your product. This, this is, is great, great because, because you can create, you can create awareness, awareness about, about your products. products. From social networking sites. From, From social, social networking, networking sites. sites. And create enough interest in the courses so that people will buy them. And, and create, create no interest, interest in the, in the courses, courses so that people, people will buy, will buy them. them. Okay, nice. Nice, nice. Any question about vocabulary or pronunciation? I don't get it. Uh, the advantage of access? Um, of the access that you may have to the web. Mm. For the access that you can have to people. Because of the explanation that he gives later, uh, he's talking about the, the phone, the internet, that people are always on the phone and are always surfing the web. So now you have access to people easily. In the past, it was not so easy, right? But now, you can have access to people everywhere. It doesn't matter if you are in, a sal in San Salvador. Imagine right now, we are connected with people in San Miguel, La Libertad, Son Sonate, Santa Ana. And, and the access that we have to people now is, 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 is easy, right? And we have more access to everybody. Mm -hmm. Any other, I don't know, uh, Jose Alberto, if that's clear for you? Yes, yes. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Any other question? Question, question? No? No question. Okay. Well, I'm going to send you to the group for you to go practice the conversation and answer these, two que these three questions. What does Sophia want to sell? What isn't she? What isn't she sure about? And what are Arnold's recommendations? Hmm? Let's see, pairs, 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 pairs. Okay, we're too weak, a poquito. Uy, si hay poquitos, poquitos, poquitos. Well, there will be one group of three and the others will be pairs. Bless you, bless you, bless you. Bless you. Thank you. <laughs> yes, sí, eh. <laughs> you know, imagine once I remember actually I was in class and the children and the children make a sick and I was like yeah sure cover your mouth and I'm going to wear my mask because they <laughs> and it's like coronavirus teacher you will make a sick <laughs> And we were visual, right? We were not face to face. I know. Vaya, let's see. Quien, eh... Okay, a ver. Me quedaron dos tríos. Who? Y Claudia. José Alfredo. José Alfredo, José Alfredo, José Alfredo. Hola, teacher. Mire, ah, todavía no he llegado a mi casa. Sí. Sorry. Sorry. Iba a preguntarle, iba a ver qué chivo ya le funciona el micro. Vamos. Sí, que estaban cargando los audífonos. Ah, that's why. Bueno, vámonos, pues. Ahí quedan two groups of three. If you feel alone, Call me, okay? If suddenly you see your partner doesn't talk to you, call me, call me. Mario, join, join, join. 
Adriana, your name is very short. Only says Adriana Escalante. Okay. Sofia. And later I can be Arnold. Right? Okay. You can share the conversation. Oh, okay. Let me try. I don't have it. The, the manual in this in this form. But do you want it in the WhatsApp? Ahorita. Um, yes, teacher. Okay. Ahorita. Um, I Yes, oh. <laughs> I can find. <laughs> I my WhatsApp is not charged. I got it. I got it. What page is twenty two? Okay. I pasted it there in the chat. What's up? Okay. Okay. And uh, you start, uh, Mr. Okay. Let me kiss that. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place like a store or, or sell to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You could sell your training course online. People are always using their phone to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create a new interest in the course okay. so that people will by them. Okay. So you start now. Okay. I would like to sell training course online. I have developed a few, but I'm not sure. What is what incense the sure about? She she doesn't sure is he should get a place like a store to sell. Uh, to course sell your brain in your course online, people are always using form and so on. What isn't she sure about? Because she says, uh, I am not sure if I shall get a place like a, a store to sell them. Uh, this, um, I think it's in the fix. The fix. In the first paragraph, if teach. You see, um, I think yes, yeah, to take advantage of access. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. What? What are Arnold's? Ah, bro. This is Arnold's recommendations. Uh, your training courses online. Okay, yeah. 
is take advantage of access. Advantage. Advantage of access. What else? I'm not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. Uh, I think the place is uh, actually uh, irrelevant. You have to take a uh, advantage, professor, uh, sí. of access. What do you mean by access? Uh, you could sell your training courses uh, online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. Uh, is that uh, this is great because you can create a uh, create a uh, esta si no estoy seguro como se pronuncia a uh, our awareness awareness no si awareness. Ah, awareness. awareness ah okay awareness thank you about your product uh, on social networking uh, sites and uh, created enough in they're interested eh? in the courses eh, so that people will buy them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sí. Okay. Ahora, Mario, con usted, si gusta. I'm Sophia. <laughs> no, you are Sophia because <laughs> Como Mario y yo, no, o como. Ya, 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 but you are Sophia. Ah, ah, ah oh, perdón, ok, bye. I would like to sell training courses uh, online. I have de developed uh, a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place like store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What? Do you mean what do you mean by access? You could oh, sell what your do you training, mean by access? You could sell your training courses online. People are always using their phone to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about your products for social networks, networking sites, and create enough interest in, in the course so that People will buy them. Okay. Now, me and me. ¿Qué sigue después? <laughs> me and <laughs> practice, 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 and practice. Me and Nubia. Okay. Me, I'm Sofia, you're Ar Arnold. Okay. I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. Teacher. Hi. I have a problem. Tell me. I can't see any buttons in my in my display. <laughs> In the in the in the zoom. Mm -hmm. In the zoom. We. Oui. Puedo salir y volver a entrar. Ajá, pruebe, pruebe, yo lo bueno. voy a acá. Uh -huh. I'm here. Hi, teacher. <laughs> hi, hi. Que me levanto porque mi compu se está quedando sin carga. Conéctala en lo que él me se sale y vuelve a entrar. No, ya, 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 ya regresé con el cargado. Y ya terminamos las preguntas. Ok. Because he has problems again. The day before yesterday was the same. Thank 
Okay. What about now? Better? Oh, I see. Okay. okay. Thanks, teacher. Okay. One Okay, let's wait for the others to come. Mm -hmm. A ver, ready, ready, volunteers. I need volunteers. Okay, Christy, do you want to be volunteer? <laughs> what did you say? Do you want to be? Do you want to be volunteer to explain the three questions? Okay. Are you going to share? Okay, you can share. And then I explain and I explain. Okay, but, oh my God. <laughs> I couldn't see, I can't see it. I cannot see it. Okay, the first one is what does Sophia what does Sophia want to sell? She wants sell training courses online. Okay. And number two, uh, what is in what is it she's sure about? She is not sure if she she, she should get a place like a store to sell them. And the number three, three is what are Arnold's recommendations? He said she could create her training courses online for social networking sites and create enough interest in their courses. Right, yeah. thank you. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Very good. Very, very good. Mm -hmm. What would you like to sell? Would you like to sell courses online like Sophia? I tried. It's better. Yeah. Have you tried? What? I tried. I tried it, but when I designed the first course, the website got a pay got from my pays from people pays a fee, but the website got a 80%, 80-20. So it's not profitable for me. <laughs> I, I, <laughs> at least 50-50, right? Because you're doing the work. So it's difficult, very difficult. Um, isn't there another way of doing it? 
Um, maybe if you, this, uh, this is when you design for a, for, for a specific site, maybe mm -hmm. other way could be when you have a target audience, for example, you have a group of people or, or ex-classmate or ex-coworker that want to learn Excel, for example, you design the course and you are your promotion, they can uh, rolling up to your, or inscribe your, on your course. This is a good way or pro, or earning it for you. Uh -huh, you register your own course, right? That, so if it's not extremely necessary to register or to use the web page, oh yes, you can create your own web page for that. Mm -hmm. This website I like, for example, Udemy. Uh huh. That that type of, of website. What is the name of the website? Udemy Academy. Ah. And they create the web page and they make all the and everything. I imagine you. You must to log to log in with your user and password, uh -huh. and they put the, the condition, and they they put the the audience. Many people searching course. This is the advantage, but it's not uh, profitable for you. Uh huh. Unless you had a lot of courses to offer, right? Yes, unless you have a thousand of, of users, for example. Exactly. But at the beginning, yeah, it becomes a little bit. Complicated. And there are courses very cheap, course for $15. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes, that's true. My daughter has bought uh, painting courses in nine, ten dollars. Yes. Of course, if you think about all the amount, of, well, that you will create the course once and then you will sell it to thousands of people, that will be profitable, right? But yeah. we wait for that to come. And you were paying the, the, the webpage monthly, Victor. It's not necessary to to. You don't pay them anything from your pocket. It's just what, uh, what they, not. what from the money people pay is that they take the money. Yes. Oh, I see. Yes. Well, at least if you don't sell, they don't take any. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. That sounds interesting. Hmm. Let's create the web page. We can make it. <laughs> <laughs> so we do the whole thing. Nice, nice, nice. Imagine something new to learn, right? Anybody else has tried to sell something online? No business people. Who, who? Sorry. Anybody else has tried to sell something? Have you tried to sell something? For me, no, because I, I, I when I want to sell something, I, at the end, at the end, I um. I give a present. <laughs> Los regalo, I don't know what to say. <laughs> oh, you give the things away. <laughs> Maybe I think may I, I think how do you say must the uno? More than more one. Than one. I more think than more than one, one of students here 
has tried to sell something, maybe his car. Oh, well. <laughs> <laughs> or when you are um, interested in, in a car, for example, you go, you start to see the price online, um, a model, for example. Nubia, yeah. Nubia sells many things. <laughs> Do you sell Nubia? Microphone. You are in mute, Nubia. Microphone, Nubia. I excuse me. Uh huh. What do you sell? What too? Yeah. Mm, because I like it. But what? 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 What do you sell? No, why? What? Ah, oh, what? Um, signed, signed, rotulos, hmm, rotulos, all signs, rotulos, ah, uh -huh. uh -huh, signs, okay, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, I sell a service for a construction okay. remodelation. Oh, nice. Okay. Uh -huh. So if I tell you I want to remodel my bathroom, you will say I sell you the service. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's interesting. Good to know. It's good to know. Good to know, yeah. For the future. <laughs> yeah. Okay, great, great. Nice. Basha, I'm going to share again. I'm not sharing. Oh, wait. Before, 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 before. Can you believe it? That is already time for the attendance. Time really flies. Adriana Maria. Adriana Sofia. Present Luiana. Creo que no está Ana. Oh, no, no, here. Cruz Antonio. Present teacher. David. Present teacher. Eddie. Present teacher. Elmer Fabricio. Present teacher. Elsa Cristina. Present. Felix. Grace Mitchell. Grace Novata. Yvonne. Jennifer Elizabeth. José Alberto. Present teacher. José Alfredo. Ok. Carla Lorena. Present teacher. Mario. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Present teacher. Okay. José Alberto, hoy es clase número 13, ¿verdad? No. Sí. Sí, ¿verdad? Quiero ver. Yes, 13. Sí, ¿verdad? 13. Ah, pues hoy le toca quedarse José Alberto. A mí. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Para que vaya mentalizando. Ok. Rebeca, Marcela, Rosy, y Rosy está por ahí. No, sé qué le pasó. Es la que estaba hace un ratito, ¿o no? No. Ok, ya por me están asustando. <ríe> Víctor. Claudia. Present teacher, present. Ok, Mauricio. Sí, hombre, es que este viernes ha venido feo. Y este que no llega el Black Friday todavía, espérense que llega el Black Friday. Ahí me dejan sentada aquí frente a la composición. <risa> <risa> ya, aquí ando comprando, teacher. Estoy yo ya porque ando en el Black Friday, mi madre. Ah, ya los vi, ya los vi. Vaya. Let's see. 
Hmm. Ok. Acha. Ok. Well, we're talking about enough before nouns, right? Enough is a word that can qualify an adverb or an adjective. And it can also be used before noun. And you see, the company does not have enough information. Remember, we said that we use it after the adjective, right? Said before the noun. The company does not have enough information about the customers so, to understand their needs. We designed enough promotions to create a short-term increase in sales. This strategy may be used to distribute enough products. A ver, mouse. Enough products. The store needs to sell enough items. There are not enough or there were not enough experts to perform the task. I don't want to talk to that customers, that customer. I really had enough. Problems. There isn't enough time to prepare a new champ a new campaign. The pizza and champagne. No. <laughs> okay, there isn't enough time to prepare a new campaign to save this product. And we are enough sources. We have enough sources to start over if it's necessary. In the platform, you have some exercises like that, right? Where you have to use enough in in noun. Okay. Teacher, teacher. <laughs> Go to back one slide, please. Okay. Okay. How do you know when use after the noun before the adjective or before the verb? Okay. If you are using a enough with adjectives, you use a first the adjective and then enough. For example, you say she isn't tall enough. She isn't happy enough, right? The ha the coffee is not hot, hot enough, or it's not cold enough. So we use adjective enough. But with the ad, with the noun, we use enough and then the noun. When is now use the enough after? No. After the noun. Enough plus noun. Enough plus noun. Enough plus noun. That I that's a good adjective plus enough. So that would be the difference. But you have this to, is a role. Okay. Yeah. But you have to know the difference between the adjective and the noun, right? Okay. In this case, information is noun. Yes, yes. Information, problems, items, experts, time, problems, resources, all these words are nouns. It doesn't matter if they are in singular or if they are in plural. If they are countable or uncountable, no problem, right? Okay. But for example, if you say enough information, right? You say, you don't say enough information. Information is a non-countable word. Promotions is countable. Products is countable. Problems, experts, items, resources are countable. But time is not. So in that case, uh, what, what you will see the difference is in the verb, right? You say there isn't enough time. There aren't enough products, right? There aren't enough products, but there isn't enough time. Mm -hmm. Okay. So the thing is that uh, uh, what 
what will be different is the verb, right? But enough, you can use it with countable nouns or with uncountable nouns. If you're using countable, plural. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 Gotcha. Check. Here we have some other examples, right? Thank you for your offer, but I think I already have enough suppliers. Yeah. There wasn't enough food. Why was my mouse? There wasn't, you see? Food is singular, right? There wasn't enough food. There wasn't enough material. Material, you use it like non-count. There wasn't enough material to, be the, to build the prototypes. I didn't have enough time. Time, no countable. There were enough retailers selling our products that we will sell them all. There aren't enough reasons, reasons plural, right, for you to quit. Go back to your post. We distributed enough left lefts to drive the villagers crazy. We have put enough effort into making this company work. There weren't enough salespeople at our store. So we were missing salespeople, right? Or a salesperson. I can't continue working. I just don't have enough energy to stand up. So you see, enough can be followed by a countable, like a retailer's resource left, let's sales people. This goes up to here. Or can be used with uncountable, like food, time, effort, energy. You cannot count the energy, right? You cannot count the effort. You say enough effort. There isn't enough effort from, from children, right? Or you need to make more effort. Or you need to give, there weren't enough uh, children giving an effort. We have to put enough effort into making the company. You have to put enough effort to pass the year. That's what you can tell your children, right? Okay. I don't know if you have any questions here. It's easier than the other one, right? Yeah. I don't know. Using it with nouns is easier than using it with adjectives. Right, yeah, check. Mm, what you're going to do here is complete the sentences using the information in the parentheses. You have the marketing department hasn't created enough interest. Yeah, I'm going to send yes. to the groups again. You're going to work in trios. I'm going to place the, the, the chart in the, in the chat, in the WhatsApp chat. And you go to work together. Let's see. No. Um, I'm going to take it from here. Okay, uh, five of them are in the manual, the other five, no. Okay, so you can see five in the manual. Well, 14, I'm going to send you in groups of three. One group will be of five. Oh. Well, one group is of four. Okay. There we go. Join. Okay. 
sorry. Vamos a ver. I feel kind of slow today. Victor Marlin. Nice. Home. Yes, I'm home. Yeah. Okay. Oh. I'm home. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. No. Okay. This is a, a big group. A big group. The heavy. <laughs> <laughs> All personalities. The VIP. The VIP. Okay. Quiero ver si tengo el WhatsApp. Este es. In the manual, you have five, but I added other five. Mm -hmm. I sent, I sent it to the WhatsApp so you can see there. Where you stand? Yeah. Okay. okay. I was problem. Oh, I has I has problem. I had problem to with what? the with the middle term with two two sentences of that then in the homework too aha uh aha -huh, uh -huh. it's the number four right the four uh, right number four mm -hmm. yeah we were talking about that with jennifer yeah yeah, yeah i i i Preview, preview is uh -huh. the, the homework yesterday, mm -hmm. I think. And uh, only that sentences I have wrong. But it's for all, all other world, I, I guess. Um, I guess, let me check, because we were talking about that. Uh, with Jennifer Lee and yesterday. Mm -hmm. But now I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> and let me see. Uh -huh, because we were discussing about that. She told me, teacher, there is a problem in in the assign in the in the in the exam. Okay. Let me see. I really don't remember, but she told me about two sentences that were giving problems. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I have five. The, the, uh, the five of them. Vaya, check. But you uh, have to remember, you have to use the first word they give you and then demand, or say, demand, right? This, the places strategy demands because it has to be demands, you have to be careful with the with the subject if the subject is singular or plural. The is singular. Demands. Uh -huh. Demands with, with S. Of, yeah, with F. Demands and no channels of distribution. I have a demand and no. Hmm? Demands and no. Enough. Enough. Uh -huh. Enough. Enough channels of this. Demand trip. enough. Channels. Why of... why enough is 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 later of demand? Because demand is a verb. A verb. Yeah. With the verb is enough later of the verb. Mm, no, the thing is that 
Uh, remember that you're talking about enough, like enough goes before the noun. Mm -hmm. Before yeah. the noun and before the uh, adjective. Uh, no, after the adjective. After the adjective. Uh -huh. and, after the adjective. Uh -huh. And the noun there is channels of distribution. Es que demanda suficientes canales de distribución. No me puede, no me puede decir suficiente demanda canales de distribución. Mm -hmm. So, okay. and that will be after the verb, but before the noun. Uh, teacher, I, I have wrong the number two. Number two. Yes, I try many. Many Did you points. write it complete? Yes, but you put capital. But but, but always is wrong. Let me see because I did only number one. Did you check the spell? Uh, the spelling. Yes. Or pros offer enough. Uh huh. Uh, future and benefits, future. but future, mm -hmm. but it's wrong in the platform. Mm, did you check if you spell features correctly? Mm. Uh, I'm sorry, what's the problem? Uh, our problem for great eye. Es que le han puesto great. Ah, ese era el error que yo tenía. Sí. La sí. palabra great. Ya, ajá, y yo ya reporté este error. A ver, ¿cuál fue el que yo reporté? Uh -huh. Because it says great instead of enough. Dos, ah, la 2.1, será que había un error, también lo reporté. Ah, y es exactamente el mismo error. Ofer, eh, es el mismo error que estaba. Bueno, voy a poner. A ver, debería decir our products offer enough. Enough. Enough issues. Great. Finish you soon then. Ya lo reporté de nuevo, esperemos. I, I, I don't know if it was fixed in the, ex, in the, in the exercise 2.11. Let me check.
No, no lo han arreglado. No. Qué lástima que no podemos arreglar con nosotros ahí. Okay. Ya lo reporté. Y si no, lo voy a volver a reportar mañana, jefe. Sí, porque aquí solo que le ponga great le va a dar correcto. De lo contrario, no. Yo así las he dejado. Picho. Pues sí, pero es que ajá. Cuando lo arreglen, si es que lo arreglan. Si yo veo que, que ya pasó bastante tiempo y el error persiste, le voy a decir. Oye, para, okay. que, para okay. que pongan ahí lo que va, lo que no va. Oye, va. Pues hoy sí, ¿verdad? You know what to do. Uh -huh. Quedamos con el Our Products. Um, our Products. Offer and of features and benefits. And of features mm -hmm. and benefits. Features. Oh. Nice. Yeah. Hi, how are you? Fine. Hi. I'm fine. Practicing English. Okay. <laughs> I came in secret to see what you're doing. No, me anda doliendo el hombro, Carlita. Ah. Mm. Me estaba dando mi, mi masajito. <laughs> que sí me anda doliendo. A más meses. Teacher, pero ese le duele porque tiene algo dañado. Sí, tengo roto el tendón. Bueno. Ah. Y ahí le toca que una artroscopía. Dicen que cosen una puntita del tendón a la otra para que quede ya remendada, anda remendada. Ajá. Ah, se le, se le ha cortado, se ha reventado. Está roto. Sí. Eh, sí, he visto. Bueno, he visto. Oh, that's a core. Uh -huh. He visto que sí, los tendones los unen con un hilito. Sí. Y le dejan reposo. Entonces, para que bueno, con el tiempo ellos mismos. También le hacen a algunos, le hacen un implante de otro. Ajá, de tendón otro. Y los unen. Eh, Del mismo cuerpo se lo quitan. Ay, no, pero qué triste, ¿no? Que me pongan tendón de vida artificial, pero que no me arranquen otro pedazo. Sí, sí, sí. Del, 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 de uno mismo le corta y ese mismo lo vestido. No, 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 thanks. Imagine, me van a arruinar alguna cosa que tenga buena para disque arreglar lo que está malo. No me parece. Hay tendones artificiales. Es de eso que me ponga. Sí, porque le quita uno tendones del pie. Pero imagínese de poco anda patoja. Atrás, que ando mal de un brazo y patoja. No. Pero y ese se lo lastimó haciendo un mal movimiento. En el bus. Oh, yeah. Ya no me vuelvo a hacer el bus. <risa> Yeah, that was in the past. Yes. Mi mamá se lastimó en un bus también, el brazo, y se lo van a operar. Ay, imagine. Imagine. Sí. I have a question in number four. Uh -huh. uh, I don't know how to, to, to use the... Talk in this case is a verb. Yeah, so we are going to use, for example, retaining you stock enough goods and sell them. Stock. 
retailers yes, no. will stock enough goods and sell them. Mm -hmm. In this case, good is not an adjective, it's a noun. Son bienes. Oh. Ajá, los bienes. Oh, los, ah, that is why I, I, I made that song a little bit weird. T shirt. Good, like a noun. Ajá, ajá. Eh, son bienes, no es adjective. Oh, okay. yeah. Tell me, Mauricio. Some of these exercises we do it last two days, I guess. We did some similar because we were working the with. Same. See? Sí. They are in the exam and they are in the, in the, in the homework too. <laughs> so if you did, if you did them, great. Aha. Uh -huh. And remember that we were talking about um, enough with adjectives. And I also told you about the use of enough with nouns, right? Now you have only enough with nouns. Mm -hmm. Created enough. Uh -huh. Interest. Easy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm and benefits. Yes, 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 yes. Ya el midterm que lo comenzaste a hacer. Sí. Ahí, teacher. Ahí. Hi, hi. Hi, hi, hi. I imagine you finished. Uh, yes. Yeah, we finished. Nice. Nice. This is. Vamos a ver. Created enough que. Interest. Interest. Okay. Our product offer. Offer enough future. Features feature. Yes. The place strategy demands. Enough channel of distribution. Mm -hmm. Demands. With S. Yeah. No. Because the noun is a, uh -huh. the place strategy. That is that is the error in the platform, I think. Uh -huh. if, Don't put S. And if you leave the demand in capital letter, it will be an error too. Yeah. Teacher in the platform okay. and number two point eleven is the see it, they have put great instead of enough and that okay. same exercise is in the exam. Okay, okay. And retailer will stock enough. Will stock enough. Good and sell them. Uh -huh, uh -huh, exactly. We lack enough information on the competition. Mm -hmm. The supply. We have to bring because I think it's necessary. Put to. This has to bring enough. Um. Well, it depends. You can say have brought. Oh. Mm -hmm. and traído, right? The suppliers have brought enough products to sell. Have brought, oh yes, like present perfect. Sí. Sí, sí, sí. Have brought, brought, uh-huh, B-R-O-U-E-H-T, T T. Okay. We have already made 
made enough commitment for a lifetime. Hi, Pubisit. Yeah. We have shared. Uh, and we, we have shared. We have shared enough essential information. Yes, shared. They are making enough money to live the, like kings. And the contract doesn't bring, bring, check the spelling, the bring. Uh -huh. bring. bring enough benefits for us. Ahí está. Nice. Okay, thank you. Okay, vámonos, pues. Okay. Eh, one minute to leave. Thank you, Victor. Okay. Okay, just seconds for everybody to be here. Only you two. Okay, a ver, number two. Mm -hmm. I can share. Mm. Or no, we yeah, can. Sure. sure, sure, sure. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Can you say? Yeah. Okay. Um, I have to read or yeah, to yeah. just read yeah, you? Yeah. You read. Okay. The first one, the marketing department hasn't created enough interest. Mm -hmm. And number two, our products offer enough features and benefits. Mm -hmm. Number three, the place strategy demand enough challenge of distribution. In that case, add S to demand. So you say demand. Oh, yeah. You go on. Demand. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Enough challenge. And, okay. In the retail, we are talking of goods and sell them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And, and number five, I had a doubt, or we have a doubt if it is present or, or past. And in the in the afterlife, eh, it doesn't it doesn't know after lack yeah. or is or or, or is uh, or it is okay. That's but, okay. That's okay. We lack um, enough information. Yeah. Um, okay. mm -hmm. uh, we, we lack enough information on the competition. And number six, the suppliers have brought enough products to sell. Yeah. And number seven, we have already made enough commitment mm -hmm. for a life lifetime. Yeah. Uh, number eight, they have shared and you know, all essential information with us. Yeah. And uh, number nine, they are making enough money to live like things. Like things. And uh, number 10, the contract doesn't bring enough benefits for us. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay. Exactly. Very good, nice. Yay. Now I have some more exercises for you related to the topic. 
on the circuit. Check this one. I can't give you an opinion. I don't have. Can you complete it? I don't have. I don't have what? Enough information. Enough, enough information. Exactly. I don't have enough information. Ay, no, espera mucho yo lo voy a escribir aquí. Me voy a mudar. Enough information. What about number two? Enough money? I don't have enough money. Mm -hmm. I don't have enough money. Okay. Okay, what about the next one? End of reason. End of reason. Read the whole sentence. End of reason. Not, Mary, not, is interested uh -huh. in that job? She has enough reason not to. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Nice. Do you need a blue pen? No thanks, I have enough. Enough what? Enough things. Okay, I have enough things now. I will buy a new car next week. I have enough money. I have enough money saved. Enough money saved. I have enough money saved. Or you can say I have saved enough money. Yeah, mm -hmm. I have I have saved enough money. Uh -huh. Me gusta más ese. I have yeah. saved. I have saved enough money. Much. Um, I don't want any more problems. I have, I have enough enough problems. I have enough problems. Have enough problems now, right? Okay, I have enough problems. What about the next one? He has I enough. He has enough experience to do a job. Uh huh. Exactly. He has enough, enough experience to do a good job. She will be a singer. She has enough, enough talent. talent. Uh -huh. She has enough talent. Nice. And the next one? I don't have enough energy. Mm -hmm. I don't have enough energy. I won't get up today. I don't have enough energy. She doesn't have enough passion. Enough patience. Mm -hmm. She will never find a boyfriend. <laughs> she doesn't have enough patience with men. Okay. And they won't succeed. They don't devote enough time to the shop time to the shop yes uh -huh. okay and the last one i don't have enough luck mm -hmm. i don't have enough luck okay i'm not a lucky person right i don't have enough luck okay questions Hmm? 
No questions. No. No. No question, teacher. No questions. Okay. Bye. Match. Match. I can't make a cake. Why I cannot make a cake? I'm going to paste it there in the in the chat. You. I don't have a no X. Teacher. Mm -hmm. Hola. Um, we can do the the homework last uh, the yesterday you said. Ah, Felix is here. No. no. I am here. Oh, Felix is here. <laughs> I'm here. Mauricio is here. Okay. Stop sharing and you share your commission. Go ahead. Make us buy your product. Okay. Let me check. Let me check. Let me check. Let me check. Oh. Oh. I have a I have a bad problems. What's happened? Oh, my pet did a mess in my house, a big mess in my house. What what they do? Oh no. My puppy makes a mess everywhere and we get a bad smell. A bad smell? Yeah. Um, I think that I can help you. How? <laughs> How do I do it? Uh, look at that. Fabuloso mm -hmm. with a delicious apple smell eliminates bad odors as well virus and bacteria and used for one fifty dollars. One fifty dollars. Oh yeah. please, please. Uh, can you give me two or more? Yeah, sure. Okay. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> Oye, tengo feta el fabuloso, es súper selecta. Y es bueno. Yes. Okay. okay. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. I can, I can close. Okay, close here. Okay. Okay, perfect. Perfect, perfect. Thank you. Now let's go by fabuloso. Okay, check. Here. Uh, I sent it to you in the in the chat, right? What you're going to do here is match match the two half of sentences, okay? Right? I'm going to give you two minutes, and then we will start checking. Two minutes, three, right? And then we will start checking. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you. 
Ok. Let me know when you're ready to chill. Here we're going to put uh, an uh, Ready, ready. Oh, a little dog. It's the one that wants to make. Ooh. <laughs> No, I move it and still doesn't fit. I want to put it. Mm -mm. I can't. Watch. Are you ready to check? Yes, yes sir. Bye. Okay. Ready. Watch. I can't make a cake. I, I don't have enough eggs. Okay. I can't find my ring. There is enough light in here. Mm -hmm. There isn't enough lighting here. Uh, she can become an actress. She has enough talent. Yes. I can't take that job. I don't have I enough experience. Have enough experience. Mm -hmm. He couldn't win the war. He doesn't have sure. enough soldiers. Mm -hmm. Oh, me falte una. Um, yes. I broke up with my girlfriend or boyfriend. I don't have enough. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have enough. Yo, <laughs> <laughs> huh? 
es, es superficial, él o ella. Porque no tiene suficientes followers. Ok, ok. Ok. Eh, he, we couldn't finish the project. We didn't have enough materials. Ok. Oh, you want to put this one? They did. <laughs> That's why they finished because they didn't have enough followers. Okay. Uh, we couldn't finish the project because we didn't have enough materials, right? Okay. Uh -huh. uh, number eight. They couldn't be elected. They didn't have enough followers. Uh huh. Ay, qué difícil hacer un ocho. <laughs> okay, um, they couldn't be elected. They didn't have enough followers, right? I can't talk to you right now. I don't have enough time. Mm -hmm. Okay, and they couldn't fire her. They have no reason. Uh huh. They don't have enough. Eh? Yes, they didn't have enough. Okay. <coughs> they didn't have enough followers. That's why they couldn't. Follow. Okay. Very good. Any questions here? Questions? No. No. We have one more exercise. We will do it together, right? Um, I'm giving you the question and you give me the response using the structure. Why didn't she finish her homework? She didn't finish it because she didn't have enough time. Why didn't he get the job? Hmm? Because he doesn't. He doesn't enough experience. Um, he, he, he didn't get, give me a complete answer. Oh, and it's a pass. Uh -huh. He didn't get the job because, because he, didn't he, have, he doesn't have. He didn't, right? He didn't, mm -hmm. he he didn't, didn't have, have enough experience. Okay. Why didn't he want to play with us? Why, 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 why didn't he want to play with us? He didn't want to play with us. Give me a complete because sentence. They don't have enough energy. Because they didn't have enough energy. Very good. Why didn't she eat lunch? She didn't eat lunch mm -hmm. because they because she didn't have enough money. money. She didn't have. She didn't have enough money. She didn't have enough money. Very good. Why didn't she ask someone to let her some? Why didn't she ask someone to lend her some, some money, right? Talking about the girl that didn't have that didn't have lunch because she didn't have money. She, uh, she didn't ask. She didn't ask someone to lend anyone. Her. Uh huh. She didn't ask someone to lend her money. Why? Because she didn't. Because she she wasn't a con, I know confident. Oh no! Because she you didn't have enough confidence. Okay, didn't have. Enough. She didn't have enough confidence, or she wasn't confident enough, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. And number six, why didn't they enroll the team in the league?
they didn't enroll the team in the league because they didn't have enough players. Nice, nice. Why didn't he wait for the answer after the interview? Why didn't he wait for the answer after the interview? He didn't wait for the answer after the interview because he didn't have didn't mm -hmm. hop didn't have you know or no he didn't <laughs> didn't hop didn't hop enough to be higher. Okay, didn't hop enough to be mm -hmm. higher. Oh, he didn't hop to be fire to be higher, right? He didn't have enough hope. Okay, we can say like that. We didn't have enough hope to be fired, to be higher. Mm -hmm. No tenía suficiente esperanza, pero ustedes tienen, quito yo. <laughs> A ver, the next one. Why didn't she make refreshment for everybody? Why didn't she make refreshment for everybody? She didn't? Mm -hmm. Why? She didn't make refreshment for everybody because she didn't have enough orange. Uh huh. Because she didn't have enough oranges. Very good. Why didn't he make the party? He didn't make the party because he didn't have. And no friends. To invite. To invite. Ay, pobrecito. He didn't... Oh, pobrecito. He didn't have enough friends to invite. Okay, why doesn't our economy improve? Now present. Why doesn't our economy improve? Our economy. Our economy. Improve. Doesn't. Doesn't improve. Mm -hmm. Because we we don't uh, we didn't we don't uh -huh. we don't create create enough jobs enough jobs yeah because we don't create enough jobs nice okay hoy sí verdad nada vamos a la tienda Yes. Everybody happy except Alberto. <laughs> Let's see. Nice, nice. Yuppie. <laughs> yes, it's Friday. Madre Ana Maria. Present. Adriana Maria, ¿dónde andaba? Yo no la había visto. Adriana María Escalante. Hola, present. Eh, Adriana Sofía. Present teacher. Ana. No hay Ana. Cruz. Cruz. Present teacher. David. Present teacher. Eddie. Present teacher. Elmer. Present teacher. Elsa Cristina. Present. Félix. No, Félix. Grace Mitchell. Grace, Grace. No, mm -hmm. Jennifer. Elizabeth. José Alberto. Present teacher. María Ivonne Marcela, no, 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 Okay, 
Eh, José Alberto, present, right? José Alfredo, ya lo vi que dijo present. Carla Lorena. Present, teacher. Mario. Yeah. Nubia. Present, teacher. Rebeca. Rosailda. Rosina y Rosa. Victor. Present, teacher. Claudia. Mauricio, Emilio. Good night, teacher. Ok, vaya. Estamos tan... Just in time. Just in time. Un palomo. Yeah. <laughs> Finally. Okay, well, see you tomorrow. No, tomorrow. See you Monday. Monday. Mm -hmm. See you Monday. Bye bye. Happy weekend. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Goodbye. Bye bye. Okay, tell me. Do you have any questions, comments? Comments, no, I don't have comments. I don't have questions, teacher. Okay. If, if this, do you need this? This is? It's more, more easy the, for the last ones. Yeah. I, 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 I think, but I don't know, teacher, I, I have, I have a little problems with the, uh, when I try putting the sentences together. Mm -hmm. in, in, in what, uh, using anything? <laughs> yes, okay. yes. I, I, can, I, can, I can understand almost, uh, almost everything. Mm -hmm. But uh, when I try to make a sentence, and putting the sentence together, mm -hmm. um, I have a hard time. <laughs> okay, um, remember the order, right? That you have to keep when you're mm -hmm. making. So you should always have the subject, the verb, and then the complement. Mm -hmm. I I think my problem is for the times. Mm -hmm. The expression. The, part, the participle. Uh, oh, the tenses. Yes. The tenses. Yeah. Mm. But uh, I have my last class of English before this program, it's like uh, 10 years ago. Mm -hmm. And uh, the, 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 the practice is I, I think the practice is very important and I I left 10 years to <laughs> talk English and yeah. I, I in this moment I have a problem with that mm -hmm. uh, but but you understand you speak you read you you understand what you read you understand what you listen so that's not a big problem um if the thing is just with the structure that you tend to mix them, you know what, mm -hmm. something that really worked for me when I was a student, like mm -hmm. a long time ago, <laughs> <laughs> was to memorize a sentence. Uh -huh. I memorized. For me, it was that problem, the present perfect. Mm -hmm. Perfect was something that was really hard for me. So what I did was that I memorized an affirmative sentence, a negative sentence, and a question. Mm -hmm. I still remember the question. Imagine that was about 1991. Oh. A long time ago, but I still remember. Yeah. Have you ever been to Panama? <clears throat> that was the question I memorized. Have you ever been to Panahashel? Yes, I have been to Panahashel. No, I have never been to Panahashel. I, I memorized yeah. that. Imagine, such a, that I remember like, oof. 
hundreds of years later. And that can, uh, that can function if um, you have problems with a specific tense, right? Mm -hmm. So you can, I remember when I was in an exam or when I had to make a sentence, I was always going to my sentence that I had kept in my mind to check like, oh, okay, this is the order. Um, okay, that's the form of it. <laughs> because if no, I tended to forget it, right? <sighs> that is yeah. something that can help you. Um, another thing is reading. Reading. Reading read English, right? Mm -hmm. Reading English. You know, the most you read, if you notice, all writers read, and they read other writers, right? And mm -hmm. later on, they are influenced by the person who they read. And the same happens when you are uh, learning a language. If you learn English, it's easier for you to write because you will have more vocabulary, because you're going to internalize the structure, right? Mm -hmm. And anytime you learn a new word, use it. Use it. So keep your notebook, write them. The word, the meaning of if it has a root or a family word, a synonym, an antonym, everything related to the right. word. And at the end, use it in context. That will help you. That will help you organize your ideas better. And with the tenses, um, there are some tenses that give more problem than others. So you can make sentences try to make sentences right first look at the examples try to follow those patterns and expose more to those tenses that you find difficult i know present perfect passive voice mm -hmm. are not easy right the think of past because we take we have to remember a lot of verbs there the regular, the irregular, and everything. Things in mind, I know. Mm -hmm. And also um, the expressions of time that you are using with each of the tenses. So you have to be sure of what is the, the, the expression of time, or some other people call it time markers that you use for the different tenses. Mm -hmm. right. Right. That will help you. But that will help you. But definitely, you have to start making your own sentences. It doesn't matter if they are not correct, right? Uh, but the most, the most to write, the easiest it will become. It's like the, the most you write, the easiest it will become. Because okay. you will get used to it at the beginning. I don't think I, I it, it was easy for me all the time to make sentences. Mm -hmm. At the beginning, it was like, I, I have to make a sentence and I have to count many. But now it's natural, but that's with the time. Mm -hmm. And the same happened to me when I went back to the university after 18 years only reading in English. I... I I didn't understand. So I was reading the material and I was like, okay. It. And I had to go look for the information in English to read it. Huh? Yeah. Because imagine after 18 years, because where I work in the morning, mm -hmm. everything in English. So it's it's everything, everything in English, right? Nothing in Spanish. Mm -mm, nothing. So things, well, well, for 18 years, writing only in English, mm -hmm. and I went back to the university and I started with the licenciatura, mm -hmm. reading big separatas, right, in Spanish. I could speak Spanish, yeah, but I forgot about the acentos, all the, the, the Spanish. <laughs> I didn't remember. And reading, and reading a big test text in, in Spanish that was also very difficult. 
Yes, very difficult. But I started reading more. At the beginning, I was investigating the information in English. I was happy with the subject that I was taking in English, but I was taking redacción in Spanish. Mm -hmm. And I remember I was taking métodos y técnicas de, no sé, algo de evaluación. And, mm -hmm. I and I was reading a lot of information and I was like, oh my God, I don't know. So I don't understand it. And I remember reading the same thing twice, three times. And then asking my husband and leave. Mm. What is it and why? Because my brain was accustomed to the to the English, not to the Spanish, right? Yeah. Sure. The same happens uh, when you tell me, and, and that came to my mind when you told me 10 years when I took my last English class, and now I don't remember. And of course, uh, with such a long time without using the language, it's normal. Right. Yeah. So what you have to do is expose more. Mm -hmm. Watch movies in English, listen to music in English, try to yeah. English, try to make notes, right? As as you're reading or as you're listening, try to make notes. Mm -hmm. So that will be giving you like an extra and you will get accustomed to it. Yeah, I I I try that. I see movies uh, in English, series uh, series in English, mm -hmm. and uh, I have uh, eight apps, no, eight pages in in Instagram only for learn English. Okay, and they have a. Uh, I'm going to give you one. Okay. This is Word Double. That is for the phone. It's a, it's a, it's an app. It's an app. Uh, yeah, Word Double. I wrote it there in the chat. Word Double. It's yeah. Word Double. That is uh, that belongs to the British Dictionary. Uh -huh. And the good thing is that you can choose if you want to learn five words every day or ten, uh -huh. right? So they let you choose. And then it, it's like you go to the gym and you exercise, right? With it. <laughs> and it's like a game. So you will find it like a game. <clears throat> Different types of exercises for you to use that vocabulary. They give you translation. They give you sentences. They give you matching, sometimes opposites or whatever. And, and the thing is that you're using the vocabulary, the new vocabulary. And you're getting uh, familiarized with that word. When, mm -hmm. when for any reason you cannot use the word, they send it to you again, again, and again, and again, and again, that same word, until they see that, that you're able to use it correctly. And you go advancing, right? And next day, you get other five words. Mm -hmm. So that helps a lot. And the best thing is that you see the word in different ways. And at the end, you see it in context too. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. So yes, I, I, have, I, have, I have one is speaks, speaks translate, translate uh, that can be used with a uh, talk. When you talk. <laughs> In, in, in Spanish and translate to the English and you can speak in English and translate to Spanish. And if you don't uh, have a good pronunciation. It corrects the pronunciation to you. Uh, yeah, yeah. And I have all other is 3000 words. It's like a game. Mm -hmm. uh, it's it's, it's same, the same, uh, the same, uh, Uh, ¿Cómo se dice? The same app. No. Ajá. No, es como la misma... Uh, la misma forma de trabajo. Ajá. Que le pone a uno a aprender mm -hmm. five words, ten words, mm -hmm. and later, you know, mm -hmm. or after that, you have to doing 
uh, like an exam. Okay, hey, that's nice. Mm -hmm. And I think it's a little uh, for help for me. Yeah, uh, you will see, you will get familiarized with the, with that thing of making sentences and creating a little mm -hmm. by little, but, but you have to just try to make more even when you find it difficult, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Get, a, get a structure. Get a structure, a particular structure, like, for example, today that we were using enough plus nouns. You get mm -hmm. a, a particular structure, and then you go for it. And that's why I was asking you today to give me the whole answer, because remember, when you mm -hmm. give the answer to a question, you don't say only because. You have to take part of the question to start your answer, right? Mm -hmm. and that helps you structure sentences better. Okay. And that's the idea. Well, I let okay. you go sleep and see you Monday. Have a nice weekend. Thank you, teacher. Have a nice weekend Bye -bye. to you. Bye-bye. Take care. Bye. Good night. Good night.